lot to chat about. We have a lot to catch up on. There's a lot going on. There's a lot to do. It's 4.53 in the morning right now. My voice still hasn't even set in, but I'm getting ready to go to the gym. Men's five inch arrival shorts and then one of the legacy bras and then 270s. Bronx. A little bit of full body hit cardio style stuff because I worked out every single day this week since Sunday. So I'm gonna go get a little workout in. I'll post it on Instagram. It'll probably be on TikTok as well. The morning from the man. We'll see you guys at the gym. So she's a little bit like in and out, but I'm going to shower, get into my cozies. I'm gonna have some breakfast. It's not even eight o'clock quite yet, so we're on track. I'm gonna show you guys how I plan like my days the day before, and how I'm able to maintain this type of routine because I know a lot of you guys are curious and you want to be able to wake up early and get things done. It's difficult, but it's it's attainable, I promise. So my shower and I'm in my cozies. I am in the skins onesie. I love this thing, I'm a onesie girl. My mom used to buy me onesies when I was little and it was just my dream. I just love it and it's so cozy and so comfortable and it has this little hood. A moment, I can wear it like this. She's diverse, she's a good time. <laughs> show you guys how I set up my days and how I've been able to just like maintain this super early schedule. First of all, I use Good Notes um, to have my planner in this app. I just find it so simple and I really enjoy it. So this is the Good Mondays planner and I absolutely love it. I just like the simplicity of it and you're able to just zoom in, write down anything you want. And I love the fact that with this planner, you're able to add different like stickers to it. So if you have something that you need to do, you can already have these little attachments on here to remind you. So if I have a day where I want to focus on self-care, I can just add one of those stickers. I just think that for me as a visual person, it's super helpful. Of course, you can use color as well. With this, you're actually able to choose if you want your week to start on a Monday or a Sunday. I chose for mine to start Monday instead of a Sunday. So this is what mine looks like. You have your priorities for the week, you have your to-dos, and then for next week, it's really nice because you can actually plan things in advance. A lot of times down here in the notes section, I will have just a gratuity log where every day I will write down what I'm grateful for. And I'll also do a little bit of journaling in this space and then as you scroll down you have your individual days and it's kind of prioritized that same way so here we have a daily schedule from 5 a.m to midnight down here in my notes as well i have my workout so i'll write this the night before i just did this one today and it was a full body workout i'll screenshot this and then airdrop it to myself so i have it on multiple places have bacon egg and cheese and turkey sandwich so good and I have all of the leftovers or anything that didn't fit on the sandwich on the side so I have some extra bacon eggs all around here and I also have just some blueberries and then I have a little honey crisp apple with lehing powder on it if you haven't tried lehing moi please do it's delicious and you will be in love eating his food right now and he's smacking his lips right under me but I did want to let you guys know that before I even I'm no longer interested in food I wanted to let you guys know that before I even go to the gym the first things that I have in the morning are greens and creatine I just started creatine I'm not a pro but I started it like a week ago, so 
She's a creatine baby right now. So you guys, this is just a little insert of my new Gymshark stuff because I told you guys I would include it in this new vlog of mine. We have new flex and new energy seamless that's coming and I'm really excited about it. I've worn a few pieces of these so far. It's just new colorways, but there's high-waisted flex shorts, leggings, a strappy sports bra, the energy seamless bra, and then I also have shorts. I also got a size small for a couple of things just to see if I like the fit any better. I'm quite literally right between a size extra small and small and I just seem to prefer the extra smalls but I wanted to give these a try. So I'm gonna walk you through these. And yes, we have a white colorway and I'm obsessed with it. I have a nude thong on and this is what it looks like. A lot of people on my TikTok at least thought that I was wearing like full coverage underwear. I never do that. It's just like there's mesh at the bottom here. I won't say that they're 100% squat proof by any means. I know a lot of people were curious about that. Well, they might not be completely like, I don't know. They might not be completely squat proof, but I honestly don't have much of a problem with them. One thing that does come into account with things being squat proof or transparent, see-through, whatever you want to call it, is your skin tone and I think a lot of people don't really understand that when you have like a little bit darker skin or you have just a little bit more pigment to your skin there's usually less of a chance that it's gonna be like super transparent on you because you have like a base layer of like a darker neutral color rather than somebody that is a bit more fair skinned. I was shocked that they were quite stand proof. I feel like some of the other colors like yellow that Gymshark has released was even more transparent than this. I'm actually really pleased with them. Obviously order at your own discretion. Next up we have the Biscotti Brown, which this color is released in the Adapt Fleck before. We've seen this color from Gymshark already. I got these leggings in a size small because I wanted to see how the difference in Energy Seamless leggings versus shorts would be. I don't have a lot of them, but ever since they released these newer versions of them, I feel like there's potential for me to like them, so. Okay, so this is the Energy Seamless in the Biscotti Brown. I feel like the shorts are so much stretchier than the leggings, even in my size extra small and shorts. I think that this color is so flattering. It's super cute on. I've always liked the Biscotti Brown colorway. We have this little mesh at the back here. It's super flattering, wow. I just have the shorts and the sports bra in this. Very bright and it's very loud, so if you wanna mix and match things, I feel like that's easier to do. I think it's glitch yellow, if it's the same color that we've seen before. I do like her, she's very loud. She's very much in your face. Okay, and now next up I have the high waisted flex leggings. These are in this beautiful like royal blue. I have the shorts here, these are the regular like OG style flex shorts. I sized up to a small in the leggings and honestly, if you guys haven't tried the flex, I find that this material is so, so stretchy. I have like the little contour here, then you have your trip track at the top of the waistband. I actually really like these in a size small. I feel like I still have a lot of stretch. And for my tall girls, I find that these are some of the longer leggings a gym truck has. Maybe it's because of the stretch. I might stick with smalls for high-waisted flex, to be honest, but these are the shorts. I love them. I posted in them. They're amazing. I just wanted to try it out. I didn't get any bottoms to match this, but it's cute if you like a little bit of a higher neck. I like this racer back opposed to this one a little bit more. I feel like Gymshark has come out with this color of flex before. This bright pink on the back. And these are the high-waisted flex shorts. High-waisted flex shorts. And then I also have the high-waisted flex leggings. I think that I stuck with a size extra small in these just to try them out. I have the matching sports bra to this. It has like this nice like pastel light green on the back. So I'm gonna try these on and then that's all. Okay, so these are the High Waisted Flex cycling shorts in that green color. I have these in a size small, which I didn't know that I did that. Maybe I'm like starting to upgrade to smalls, you guys. I don't know what's going on. This is what the green color looks like on the back. Cute. Now let me try on the leggings in the bra. Okay, and here are the leggings. I got the leggings in a size extra small. I'm vibing with the smalls a little bit more, to be honest. The bra is nice. I feel like we've all seen this bra a few times. I find that like going with the extra small versus the small, it's definitely tighter in like the crotch area and of course the waistband. Like I would assume that with different sizing. Those are the new colorways and new pieces that I got from Gymshark. There is no launch date yet, but if you guys do want to shop these when they drop, you guys can use the link in my description box. That directly supports me. I get a little bit of commission from it. And if you guys do that, make sure that you send me your order confirmation to be entered into my monthly giveaway. But back to the vlog. Sorry for the interruption. I just feel like we need to talk about my recent reads, my recent books, because <gasps> you guys saw me pick up these books not too long ago, okay? 
life has been changed. This is my cozy place. I like to sit on the couch when I read and sometimes I will allow myself to take a little mini snooze after I've read quite a few chapters. Miss Colleen Hoover has done it again. She blows my mind. I can't believe I didn't find this woman earlier, but I feel like I found her at the right time in the right like season of my life. And I can't get enough. So my first book that I read from her was It Ends With Us, blew my wig off. It was so good. And I think that is such a good like introduction to Colleen's writing style. And then the next book by her that I read was Ugly Love. This is such a good book. There's a lot going on. She just like tells such a story in such a vivid and believable and like realistic way. But also you know that it's fiction. This thing, this novel right here, this novel changed me as a person. Verity scalped me, stole my soul, my edges were gone, broke my limbs in half, and then yeeted me off of a building. You have to read this. If it is the only book by Colleen Hoover that you read, let it be Verity. I read this within 24 hours. I literally sped through it. I was like, everybody's hyping this up. I don't know what's going on. You'll read it and you'll be in the book and you'll be like, this is a good book, but like, what's up? Once you finish this book, you're a changed person. Then you have this internal dialogue going on for so long that you're trying to figure out. So good. This is like the quickest book I've read and it is just incredible. I'm currently reading November 9th and I want to say that I like this a little bit more than Ugly Love. I don't know if that's controversial or not. You have a couple of characters from Ugly Love making an appearance in this book. You don't have to read them in any specific order. I know a lot of people are curious about that. Let me know what other books by Colleen you guys recommend. I have Layla that's here and then I already pre-ordered Reminders of Him. That should be here this week. I'm wanting to finish this right before that gets here. I'm a reader now and my goal for this year was to read a book a month. I've almost done three books in a week, so she's on it. Hopefully I don't slow down. Do you wanna see who's near me? You wanna see who's chit chatting with us? This man. Hi, man. I just went on live for a hot minute and talked to you guys about Kendra and Catherine's collab with Gymshark. If you guys shopped, I hope you guys are getting all of your stuff and enjoying it. I'm just really excited to see you guys in all of these pieces. So what I'm doing right now, I'm going through my emails and everybody that has that's used a link or code of mine, as you guys know, gets entered into my monthly giveaway. And I'm so thankful that there are so many of you guys that do use my links and codes, literally hundreds of you guys every single month. One big part of that that does not get to be looked over is the fact that I have to go through all of my emails. I do it myself. This is a one woman show here and I have to put them into certain folders. So then I'm able to go through like giveaway entries entirely. I label that and then a subtopic or a subheading of that is giveaway entries for a January giveaway. This takes a little bit of my time, especially after a big Gymshark launch or an Alani launch. This is a task that I'm so thankful to have because there's so many of you guys supporting me. I am obsessed with this Dawn Power Wash. It's so simple to clean things because it's this continuous mist. If you haven't tried this, I'm sure everybody has this in their house by now. You can even wipe your counters off with it. I'm obsessed with it. And it makes doing your dishes so simple. And also, if you guys don't have a scrub family member, this one is a scrub mommy. I just feel like these are some kitchen items that everybody needs to have. Also, absolutely in love and obsessed with my always can. Let's assemble our lunch. All right, so this is everything that you're going to need. I promise it's super simple. And then also, I just have the red hot wing sauce. Got these out because you can do a lettuce wrap or you can do like a regular wrap with a flour tortilla, but I recently, as of yesterday, have become a Siete gal. Just have some chicken breast. I have a Chobani Greek yogurt. What I do with this is I make my own ranch. One of these like ranch powders inside of there, actually not all of it, just like some of it, in a regular Greek yogurt. And it makes this amazing thick ranch dressing. And I know a lot of people also substitute like Greek yogurt for sour cream, that type of thing. Shredded lettuce and you should be good to go. You need some cheese. So I have a shredded cheese. It's just provolone and mozzarella blend. Chicken is precious. 
Come on now, well seasoned. Good stuff, good stuff. So I made extra chicken because there's a good chance we're gonna have these later on for dinner. Such a simple little meal and you can make as many as you want. That's what I think is great. Also, I don't count any calories. I just know that this looks delicioso. So you just pick it up, you wrap it. So good, so simple. So I'm headed to my hair appointment and I'm just going to bring an Alani Fit Shake because I know hair appointments take a long time sometimes and I just wanna have something in my tummy. Um, and then I'm also filling up my water bottle and bringing this with me as well. So I finished reading November 9th in the salon chair and my wig is gone. I'll talk to you guys in the morning. It's a rest day for me. I'm not waking up super early. I started my week of workouts on Sunday. Today is Thursday. So I've got my five out of the way. I feel so good. Good night, I guess. Good night, I love you. I'll see you in the morning. I'm back on my protein coffee. I just used the Stoke cold brew and then an Alani fit shake I like the vanilla ones and then also munchies. They're all good though I'm going to do my theragun for a little bit just for some like recovery because I'm hitting the gym again starting on Sunday And I just need to be up and ready and fully capable of doing that here that I ordered but I got some boots I want to try them on with this outfit but please know that I will not be wearing them together am I going horseback riding right now wait just got another Amazon delivery and I think that this is my oversized Sherpa hoodie. I'll be wearing this every day. So it's a Sherpa hoodie slash blanket. I know. Hello? Oh my goodness. I am obsessed. Please. It's basically like Skims, but a different version of it. Oh my gosh, there's Sherpa everywhere all right you guys i've done a little bit of worky work and i figured out kind of how my mirror will look when i do have it completely set up so i just put these little bins under it because they're about the same height as the baseboard it added so much like height up here which i really like i'm gonna go get some boba because i haven't got boba in a little while let's go get some boba i have retrieved the boba and i'm so happy person before me paid for my boba and that was amazing if you guys enjoyed this video and you liked hanging out with me please make sure to give this video a thumbs up also be sure to subscribe so you don't miss another video with me and you guys can keep up with me every single day on instagram at libby christensen and i will talk to you guys later